Hey Taurus, I'm back guys with another video. So let's start off. We're going to use the Millennial Oracle. And these are going to be general reads, so it may or may not resonate with you. If it happens to resonate, all the better. Be sure to hit the thumbs up as well as share with your family and your friends. All right, so let's get a general message for Taurus. We got flatlining, all right? So um, this is a relationship or a situation is dying, conversation went dead, can't be resurrected, or lost interest, okay? This could be texting, okay? Um, you could be texting someone or someone could be texting you. You're in communication with somebody and you're not interested in what they're talking about, what they're saying. You're taking a digital detox, okay? So some of y'all are cutting y'all phones off, okay? Because, yeah, y'all not having it. I'm seeing a conversation just going flatline. Um, and some of y'all are just deciding, like, look, I'm just going to detox from this. It could be social media, or it could just be cutting your phone off because it's like, yeah, not not even. <laughs> yeah, you're you're busy being an adult, okay? You're busy being an adult. You're adulting right now. You're uh, making, you know, adult decisions. You're taking charge of your life. You're putting in the work. You're being mature and you're being responsible. Okay, so you got responsibilities. It's like I don't. I'm hearing I don't got time to be doing all this texting and talking on the phone for no reason. Like, yeah, you know, like mm, I'm gonna chill on that. I'm taking a chill pill on that. I'm, I got things to do. All right, because yeah, we got the struggle is real. All right, so some of y'all may have just came out of a struggle period. And you're like, yeah, that's going to be the end of that. All of that ratchet stuff going on, all of that. Yeah, mm, no, nah, we not going to do all that. Because right now, I got better things to do. I got other things that I could be focused on. What other messages there for Taurus? Yep, cancel. Y'all are canceling plans. Y'all are like, uh, it's nothing. Y'all dismissing some people. Y'all rejecting the idea. Y'all just not interested. It's like, you just like, nah, I'm good. I'm keep getting it. Like, nah, I'm good. All right. Now we got orbiting, digitally observing a love interest, keeping tabs, staying connected, stalking a crush or a coward. I feel like someone could be watching you or you're observing something. Somebody's been keeping tabs, but we got no chill. You may be feeling like somebody's overreacting. Maybe you overreacted in a situation with a bae, with a boo. All right. So it's caused you to kind of like, you know, cancel some things because you got to focus on this. You got to focus on your responsibilities. All right. So let's jump right into the tarot and let's see what we get. So this is interesting for Taurus. Any message for Taurus, please? Give me a message for Taurus, please. What message is there for Taurus?
All right, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Three of Swords. All right, so, and the Six of Swords. Yeah, you're trying to get over, you're moving past something that was um, hurtful, heartbreaking. There could have possibly been a breakup. You're seeing things more clearly, like you are aware of something. You're aware of something. I see. Three of Cups in the world. Hangman, Temperance, King of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, Empress, the Magician, Two of Wands, and the Queen of Swords. I'm getting like some of y'all could be like in a group chat. I want to say that like possibly like some type of group chat where it's females involved that's a storyline that i'm getting as well some of you could be dealing with a baby mother or a baby father or a mother or a feminine energy but i'm sensing a lot of growth okay i'm sensing a lot of growth you're deciding to put this circle this friend this this group circle on hold okay because you're trying to balance things out you you got other things on your mind. You're looking at your priorities. Why is the hangman here? Yeah, eight of cups. You're walking away from some friends, some circle, a group. You're putting it on hold. Yeah, it's a bunch of people around you that you need to close a chapter with in order to have some type of balance or peace. I'm hearing what goes around comes around. Some of you could be dealing with the Libra. But yeah, you're watching somebody. This is something that possibly is on the internet that you are observing. I feel like you're observing friends, the people that you're around. Maybe you feel like, you know what, maybe I need to put this on hold. Because right now, I need to find some type of balance. Okay, now temperance is here. And the queen of pentacles, yes. You are, your focus is to have a balance and peace. Okay. I feel like maybe you've been doing a lot of running around with the knight of wands. A lot of back and forth. A lot of being all over the place. A lot of just, you know, like, um, you know, just not being able to kind of like just sit down in the, in the, Take in everything. So some of you are definitely like, yeah, it's time for me to have, find a balance. Some of you could be dealing with the water sign, with the king of cups here, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio energy. You've been giving your energy, uh, you've been giving away a lot of your energy in the past. I definitely see that. And this could have possibly left you feeling like this. Okay. Um... Four of Cups energy is very, you know, kind of bored, discontent, not really interested, um, not caring, okay? Like, you've been giving your energy so much to this, whatever this is that you was in the past, when you've been giving so much energy to it, like, it's like you don't even really, you know, you start to get bored with it or not interested, I'm sensing somebody, some, I'm clearly hearing somebody needs to go back and apologize. Possibly, it sounds like to some children, children could be involved.
I feel like you were trying something new in the past. And you was giving it a lot of energy. Like you was giving a lot to it. All right, so we got the seven of pentacles for future energy. This is investing. This is being patient, waiting on your harvest to grow. Now, let's see what's here. Yeah, three of pentacles. So you're working on, you're working towards something, but you're taking your time with it. You're not rushing. I feel like you rushed the last time and, and it took a lot from you. So this experience has caused you to go through growth, okay? You have grown through this experience. Yeah, and now you know how to move forward from here on out, okay? You know how to move forward. I'm definitely sensing a lot of growth, a lot of growth, lots of growth. Now, the person that you that's in your environment is the magician. Their energy is the magician. So let's see. I see them trying to warn you or make you stop uh, doing something. They are over here stressing out. Um, yeah, they're really, really like um, they're stressed. Okay, this person that you're dealing with, they don't feel secure. In their position could be a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or they don't feel secure um, in a marriage or a home life, a domestic, domestic in a domestic vibe. Okay, they feel stuck or they're afraid that um, they're gonna have regrets. Five lovers here. It could be dealing with the Gemini. The Ace of Wands. Fire energy. This person is hurt. Um, this person could act really irrational when they get hurt. Um, but they're trying to make you stop doing something. Like, they're trying to get your attention. They're trying to get your attention. So, it looks like this person re reacts out of hurt to get your attention. Now, the two of wands is here in your hopes and fears. So, you look at... At the future, okay. You um you fear that you may change your mind. Um yeah, it's like uh something's just giving you bad vibes. It's like someone's giving you bad vibes. You fear that in the future. Could be a queen of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We got the Queen of Swords here as the outcome. The Knight of Pentacles. So I feel like some of you think that you need to slow things down. Um, things were moving pretty quickly. I feel like you were giving your a lot of energy to something. And you're just finally taking a look and observing what's for you, what's not for you. Um, so some of y'all are going to be deciding to slow down okay you think that things need to be slowed down i don't feel like you want to take any big huge risks right now i 
I see you trying to get closer possibly to a fire sign or an Aquarius. You have a hope for a situation. Okay. I want to go to In My Feelings deck and where's, we'll see what we get from there. Let's see what we get. All right. So, tell me more about the situation. For some of you, this is like dealing with a home situation. Okay, in this in the environment, it is causing anxiety, causing you to have like some type of anxiety, but this could be going on in your home. Okay. For some of you, world travel is just flipped over. Some of you um recently went on a trip or is thinking about taking a trip or getting ready to take some type of trip yeah this is definitely something home okay something about home life is really tense okay something about your home life you could also be feeling kind of guilty about a situation um but i feel like this has something to do with home now we got journey like i said for some of you there may be like a trip involved but i'm getting like home life could be kind of tense okay home life could be tense actually the police you may be nervous that the police could possibly possibly get involved we got protect and serve and somebody's having to protect their family or feel the need but I'm definitely getting, like, family, home life. Okay, give me one more card. Yeah, some of y'all feel sad or someone's feeling sad. I'm feeling like somebody's feeling guilty about something. Is there something that you could feel sad or guilty, guilty about or feel like something could have been done differently? Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right, so that's the message that I got for Taurus. If this resonated with you guys, be sure to hit the thumbs up as well, guys. Share with your family and your friends. If you're new, go ahead and click that subscribe button. All right, until next time, ciao.